All right, hey Virgo, so I am doing a ghosted energy read for you guys. You're going to know this is your read by your energy and how you feel about the person that's coming through the read. So if that doesn't resonate, check your moon rising and Venus placements. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. I do hope you guys will subscribe if you feel inclined. All right, let's just see what your energy is. You're kind of going back and forth right now. Devil card. Okay, so your energy is coming through as um, the Knight of Coins, and this is the wounded. War this is the wounded warrior knight. All right, when it comes to the knights, and this is somebody who's already had it rough, and then it's like some shit comes through, and it's unimpressed energy. Really, um, I don't feel like you're coming through as the Devil card. I feel like you're coming through as the wounded warrior, and the person on your mind is the one that's kind of giving that vibe, like you. have you are dealing with some negative energy. You're dealing with negative energy, but it's coming through, I feel, as a person. All right. I feel like you're kind of going back and forth on whether or not you really want closure or to accept um, this situation as it is with this person. I feel like you could, there could be a day where it goes by and you're just like, screw this person. You know, they hurt me. Um, but also too, I kind of feel like you're, you go back and forth. The two of coins to me is all about juggling that energy out to the universe. I want to talk to this person. No, I don't. Yes, I do. No, I don't. I feel like you're kind of going back and forth, but I feel like the, the most, um, I feel like the biggest energy is coming through as right now you're just hurt by this person's actions, by their deeds. All right. This is a ghosted read. They ghosted you. Um, so I feel like you're just really hurt and you're kind of looking at this person like they're the devil. They're the devil energy. The devil card to me, you guys, is all about somebody who embodies ego. Um, so it could just be that you got hit with somebody that uh, lives in their ego. Um, you know, that's the part that they show most prominent. Uh, that's that's who they show that they are, this devil energy. So this is somebody who cares about what people think. They care about what people say about them. They care about everything but, you know, hurting people, really. It's almost like if... This person's only ever dated blonde haired people or buff people that go to the gym. Um, it's like you don't fit into that criteria. And um, this person is, it's almost like this. I almost kind of feel like this person can't be seen in public with you. All right. I just feel like they live through ego. How do you feel about them? How do you feel? This person at one point in time made you very happy. All right. At one point in time, they made you happy. Um, here's what I'm going to say. I feel like, um, you experienced happiness with this person, but I feel like it's kind of, uh, flaked off a little bit. All right. How you feel about them? The devil card with that ace of wands energy just tells me maybe you feel used by this person. Uh, could be an air sign that you're dealing with. Um, even the king of swords didn't come out upright. Um, it still came out kind of halfway. So I feel like some of you guys really don't know what to think about this person. Could be that you're dealing with, um, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right. And you know, that's supposed to be some honest, loyal energy, but I feel like they're just disengaging in that. All right. I feel like it was kind of, you guys could actually even feel used by this person. Um, and you're not really sure what to think about the situation. The sun card tells me that at one point in time, you were happy with this person, but even the sun card came out sideways kind of, uh, yeah, they did at one point in time, make me very happy. I was looking forward to getting their their phone call or their text message, you know, I was looking forward to seeing them. Um, but I kind of feel like that's kind of fall. It's fallen through the cracks and I feel like it's fallen quick. So the person that is on your mind, their energy, their energy. I really love the ghosted stories, you guys. And it's just because, um, people who ghost, I mean, the situation never really closes out. All right. Um, here's what I'm going to say. The seven of wands did come in reverse and I feel like this person's kind of done thinking about themselves. All right. I feel like this person um, embodies like a lot of um, it's like this person might only think about themselves truly. And I feel like they're they're because the seven of wands is coming through in reverse. I feel like they're kind of having this come into Jesus where it's like I can't always think about that. And it's not in the spiritual sense. It's like truly this person is living through ego and they only think about themselves. But the fact that that card comes in reverse tells me that they're starting to kind of think about what they did. The page of swords tells me that they're probably checking out your profiles on social media. Um, 
or even watching tarot. They could be watching tarot to see what's going on with you. All right. I do feel like they want the new beginning. They don't want it to be over with. Um, and they don't like the way they feel ever since they've ghosted. All right. The six of swords kind of tells me when it comes in reverse. Um, this pro this person's probably had more issues getting, getting relationships and situations off the ground um, than anything else. And it's because this person doesn't know how to, to um, they don't know how, they don't know how to come out of their own, um, uh, what am I trying to say? Like their own mud, mud hole, you know, it's like they dig themselves in these holes and they don't ever even try to get out. It's like, they don't even put time or attention into trying to get out or, or being how they are. I feel like you're actually giving this person a run for their money though, making them think about probably everybody else that they've ghosted out on everybody else that they've wasted time on, you know? Why? Let's just see how this person feels about you. How do they feel about Virgo? The full card. Yeah, they want a new beginning with you, Virgo. They want to come through as a Knight of Cups. All right. They know that they've hurt you. Um, I feel like you guys can probably sense each other's energy, but they want to come through as a Knight of Cups and um, offer a new beginning. This is going to be a 30-day intention read, um, if not a confirmation. So let's just see why they ghosted. Why did they ghost? Why did this person ghost Virgo? All right, so we have two energies coming through. This person doesn't know what they want. I feel like they're uh, dealing with you and somebody else. So right now they're having a hard time coming through. It's like they really feel the, the love connection with you. I feel like the Empress represents your energy. You make them very happy. Um, but I also feel like there's somebody else ling lingering in this person's energy. Now, I'm not going to go through and say this person's married. Could be that this person is married. All right. Um, but they do definitely have somebody else on their mind. And they're having trouble kind of deciphering what they want as far as happiness goes. Um, I almost feel like this person is single. I don't feel like they're married. But I do feel like they are torn between two. Okay, um, so let's just see if they're coming back. The Knight of Wands energy, they're coming back. They're coming back under um, the Knight of Wands energy, which is more about inspiration. And the reason why I'm saying that is because it's uh, coupled with the King of Coins. All right, so this person is going to come back. They're going to come back. Um, I feel like it's going to be very, very unexpected. This is somebody who uh, takes a shot. They go for it. I feel like this energy is going to come out of nowhere. I don't feel like they're coming through as a player. I feel like they're coming through to offer stability. Um, they're coming through to offer what they should have done in the, per the first place. Tell you how they feel, um, how you've kind of changed. So I feel like um, in this person's torn between two essence, Virgo, I feel like they're going to come back and choose you. All right. But again, we have free will. So really it's up to you on whether or not you want to entertain this person. So are they going to tell the truth as to why they left? They are. They're going to tell the truth. Um, they're going to, they're, they're going to tell you the full thing. I feel like, well, we weren't together. Um, I was seeing other people. Um, we never solidified anything. All right. But I feel like you have, uh, spiritually transitioned to this person. All right. I do feel like you guys are going to start something new for many of you. I feel like there's going to be a new start up ahead and union. Um, they're going to come back and tell you that they want to be with you. I do feel like they're going to tell you that they were dealing with other energy, but it's not as it wasn't nothing serious. Okay. So let's just see what your advice is the next 30 days. The next 30 days advice. Whatever you guys want, Virgo, whatever you want to see come come through on this is going to be a, it's going to be your choice. All right, but where you feel hurt and pain right now, you're going to come out of that by receiving um, news from this page of wands. All right. And I feel like you could be dealing with wands energy. Um, but you're going to have whatever it is that you desire out of this connection um, come through. All right. So it could be positive for some of you guys. Some of you guys could be hurt and you're not ready to, to speak. You're not ready to rectify or reconcile this um, connection. All right. But that's totally up to you. Um, so let's just pull some initials and see. And just remember that the cards is the energy I draw. It's not, not necessarily the initials. So if your initials or this person's initials don't come out, guys, just this is where it's at. All right. So Virgo, you're coming through with T, M, F, H, O, G, and P. 
all right you guys so if this is a confirmation read for you guys or you experience this and resonate with the energy um, i would love to hear your story or your feedback um, and if it just resonates in general uh, if you guys would uh, click the like button so that other people on youtube have the opportunity to see the messages i would greatly appreciate it all right you guys take care